Ay, ay, ay. All I bitch who is your mess, ay. Can't keep my dick in my pants, ay. My bitch don't love me no more, ay. She kicked me out on life, bro. Yo, it's the Gibbonator, and if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. And if you're already a subscriber, welcome back to another video. Today, I've got you a really helpful video. If you didn't know, they've already nerfed the MV4 and K Bar, which were the two best guns in Infinite Warfare. Now, they were the go to guns for core and hardcore, but I think I may have found the new best gun for core. Now, I don't play Core at all. This is my first ever game playing Core Domination, and I get a deatomizer strike. And normally, most people, when they're going for deatomizers, they use the MV4 and the K bar, which I've, I've used the MV4 before in Core TDM, and I really didn't like it. I found that it was really inconsistent, and at ranges like this, I'd always be getting outgunned. I'd get first shots on, but people would still be kidding me. So uh, that's the main reason I don't play Core and I play Hardcore, but now I've found this gun I'm gonna start playing core a hell of a lot more because with this gun I mount kids it doesn't matter what range you see there that's like halfway across the map mounted him and then right there that's point blank mounted him it's just so good at every range and I just find myself outgunning mv4s non-stop so I would definitely prefer this gun over the mv4 especially now it's been nerfed so if you haven't give, given this gun a go yet I definitely recommend you go ahead and do that because you're missing out otherwise and all I've got on this gun is quick draw, foregrip and silencer. That's all I was using and I go on a 35 gun streak. So this is my first ever core deatomizer and I could have had the double as well. I actually mess up at the end. I'll talk about that when we get to it. But if you have the nuke variant for this gun, definitely use it over the fallout. Um, I haven't actually tried the nerfed MV, uh, the, sorry, the nerfed K bar. So that could still be good. I'll give it a go soon. But what everyone's saying is that um, they're still pretty good, but um, they haven't tried this gun yet because this gun mounts kids There's no way that my first game using it, it would be like a coincidence of it being good It has to be good because I've tried with MV4s to get the atomizers and I just can't do it in core um, I've also been trying the type 2 because they buffed that as well And that's pretty sick to choke to double earlier and yeah, it was really annoying But I have no idea how I survived that grenade there for the deatomizer strike But in exactly the same spot in the next round of the game I uh, Another person, yeah, right there, again, I survived I don't even have a flak jacket on so I don't get that um, Normally I would die straight away to nades But um, you'll see in a minute I waste my rewind And I really messed up because it would have gotten me... Um, the double deatomizer. Um, I try challenging a couple of people. I do my rewind. It's about here, yeah. Um, I use it there when I even I kill the kid, and now it screws me over for the double. But um, if you found this video helpful and you like the look of this gun, be sure to smash the like button. And as I said at the start of the video, if you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe for more insane gameplays like this and just tips and tricks in general. So um, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.